Now, <laughs> we first met Bonnie Anderson over a decade ago when she was just a little girl. Look at her there, oh, singing her oh. heart out on Australia's Got Talent. She was the winner of that first series and it set her up for a career in music. And now the next big adventure begins for Bonnie because she's joining Neighbours and she is oh. with us now, all grown up. Hello, Bonnie. Hey, Bonnie. Hey. Hey. How are you all? Oh, you are just gorgeous. We're great. We want to take a look at your very first moments on Ramsey Street. Have a look. Maybe oh, someone with a lot is. to hide. Uh, tell us about your character. It must be pretty fun playing her. Oh, it's Beatrix is really cool. She's um so she's she's a tough love kind of girl, you know. She's had a hard life, a really tough upbringing, and um there's some similarities with myself and Beatrix where you know we wear our heart on our sleeve, and but she there's also some complete opposites where she's quite awkward, and takes a long time to trust anyone, you know. And it's been interesting trying to play that character and learn about her and do all of these things because myself I always want to make things better with awkward situations you know and um, it's been just amazing getting to know her and and just learning and working with these amazing other actors like Jody Jody and Aster, who is my mm. oldest sister on the show and um, who plays Ellie it's just it's just been an absolute pleasure and you know just growing as an actor and and personally it's been I, awesome I've noticed yeah. that you have a, a be tattooed on your hand. I do here. Oh, is that for Beatrix? <laughs> no, it is for Bonnie. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> that's brilliant, Sarah. Oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. They actually god. um they thought they were pretty smart with thinking that mm. that was just one less tattoo that they had to cover <laughs> oh up every God, day. What a blonde moment. <laughs> yeah. Uh, sorry so about that. Yeah, every character, once they join the neighbours' cast, they get branded. Now, now, body being on that lease sales. <laughs> Let's hope you keep being called B names in everything. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, forever. But, but neighbours is, of course, hugely popular in the UK. So yeah. are you prepared for, you know, an influx of fans and popularity and gigs, uh, maybe, in From the Britain. UK? Also starts with a B. Yeah, oh, yeah B for Britain. <laughs> a B for badass. <laughs> It's, um, it's crazy. I actually went to London just not that long ago and it's, um, it was a lot of fun. I'd never been before and it was before I was announced. So I can't wait to go back and um, be able to talk about it, you know. And I do know that UK, there's a lot of fans there and they, they love to watch the show. So it's going to be really cool. Well, that's just the start of it, isn't it, Bonnie? I mean, you've got to release an album, you've got to go to London, you've got to star in a pandemime, you've got to become a gay icon, you've got to move to LA, you've got to start with Michael yes. Crow. Um, it's it, all happening. <laughs> is it intimidating to join a show that just has that incredible legacy? I mean, that's it's been not only going for so long, but launched just so many superstar yeah. careers. Yeah, yeah, it's it's really wild. It's an amazing show. You know, you learn so much. It's such a quick, quick going show. You know, you're constantly reading lines. You know, my memory has excelled so much in three months mm. of filming and and just reading constantly, and. Um, you know, watching all of these other artists and different actors and what they're doing now, you know, it's just incredible. And I'm, I'm still working on music, you know, I'm writing lots yeah. and I can't wait to release music at the end of the year. I've just been working on really honest material and, and you know, it's got so much substance to it and, and truth. So I can't wait to get it out there and, and hopefully people can connect to it. And, uh, speaking of your music career, I mean, you started on a, a talent show, I guess, and, you know, I'm no stranger to those. When you yeah. look back at your time on Australia's Got Talent, what advice would you give to young people who want to get their start in an avenue like that? Yeah, I mean, I get asked this question all the time and my favourite thing to say and what I took on board was just take every opportunity, you know, because it can be good, bad, you learn from the bad, you learn from the good. I mean, when I went on the show, I had no idea what it was about. It was the first, sh first time the show was airing, so 
it was a crazy whirlwind. I experienced so much amazing stuff, met great people. And even this show, you know, when I auditioned, I didn't know I was going to get it. I didn't, you know, and I actually auditioned for another part in the show and I didn't get wow. it. You know, and they created my role, Beatrix, and, and it just worked out perfectly. But you just, you never stop. You just keep on keeping on and you learn and just, you know, grow as a human and in all of these avenues where you want to go in life. Oh, that's great, buddy. And also, if you are having difficulty remembering your lines, just try tattooing them on your hand. <laughs> <laughs> so really the makeup convenient. people will kill me. Oh, gosh, I'm never going to live that down. Our Bonnie's First Neighbours <laughs> episode is tomorrow night. The yes! show is on at 6.30 weeknight. It's on 11 and the Win Network. Bonnie Anderson, you are just gorgeous. Thanks so much Thank for you playing. Thank you. Thank you.